Hello everyone and welcome to this walkthrough of SSH Ninja. So my name is Sad and today I will be guiding you through the first part of this lab where we'll focus on enumeration and peripheral escalation technique to gain root access. In the second part, my friend Josh Tech will cover the remain challenges. So without further ado, let's get started. So uh, the first thing first, let's start. Or let's get started by connecting to the VPN. I'm gonna download it from here. All right. And yeah, so we're gonna first start by scanning the target machine with the map to identify the open the opening ports and uh, running services. So for that, I'm gonna type uh, sudo in map dash sc and dash sd. So I'm gonna explain each one of this flag and that's why I'm gonna call it my Then here I'm gonna type in the target machine ID. Right? So uh, uh, we did like the, the dash sc is like the flag for the default script, and he, then we have like a dash uh, sv, it's like for a version detection, and the dash on is for the, in order like to save the output in uh, this myscan1.txt file. Then, as you can see, uh, like from our in-map result, we identified an acceptable server that may be vulnerable to brute force attack. So, uh, for that, we we'll use Hydra to enumerate valid user and passwords. So, we're gonna type in Hydra. So, uh, first, I'm gonna like use um, a custom user, uh, a custom board list uh, username. So let me see. And we're gonna use Hydra to user enumerate on the target. So Let's try to use this credential to log into the SSH. So, because after successfully identifying a valid username and password, we have like um, logged into uh, the the server, but we have uh, we uh, uh, we have like uh, user uh, privileges. So we want like to gain uh, uh, root privileges. So. Let me see, see the root. Let's try to cut both. So as you can see, we have permission denied. We don't, we don't, uh, the user don't have like the, the, the sudo permission. Let's try to do sudo cat both. So we need, the user is not in, in the sudo file. So for that, we're gonna like check the permission. So as you can see here, the user have like the right 
to write in uh, the SSH directory which is like uh, within the root directory so we're gonna exploit that And let's add the uh, public key to the, or to the authorized keys in our target machine. Let's go back and try to log in to the root machine using the private key. As you can see, we have like successfully gained access as well. Now we can test and add to get the, the second flag. So, as you can see. That's it for the first part on this lab. We start by scanning the network with InMap, then we used Hydro to build first login credential, and finally exported file permission to capture the root flag. So stay tuned for the second part of the lab where uh, Josh Ted will walk you through the remaining challenges. And if you enjoyed this workflow, don't forget to like, subscribe, and leave a comment below. Thanks for watching and see you next time.